I S U P K. Lifestyle, man. Right. The lifestyle that is against God, man. Right. The lifestyle to be a homosexual. Right. The lifestyle to, to do drugs, man. Right. To be a drug addict. To to um to murder your own brother, man. You only hate your brother because you love the white man. Right. Whatever the white man hate, that's what you hate, black man. Right. Keep reading. To observe and to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day. Black man, we were supposed to do the um we were supposed to keep the law, statutes, and commandments of God. But right now, right now, I can see right now that we are not keeping the law, statutes, and commandment of God. Only back here, we are keeping the law, statutes, and commandment of God. And we are out here to raise up our brothers out of this sleep that the white man has put them in, man. You in you are in a coma, man. The white man has put you in this white fantasy la la land world, man. That you living in, man. You are living in an illusion, man. America's just nothing but an illusion to you black people. Thinking you free in America. Ain't nothing free in America for black people, man. Right. Everything everything that's free for you is to get killed in America, man. Right. The white man love to murder you, man. Murdering is sport for the white man to you, more black people, man. Keep, keep reading. That all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. All these what? Curses shall come upon thee and I will take thee. Black man, Hispanic man, Native Indian man, the only reason you living in the condition you in is because you under a curse. You're cursed by the Lord, man. The Lord done cursed you, man. That's why you living the way you living, man. In poverty, under the stinking white devil. You got the white Jewish man over there claiming to be you, man. Because you done disobeyed the Lord, man. So the Lord let all these tragedies and all these all these bad things happen to you, man. Cause you done disobeyed him, man. Right. Black people think God is only love cause the white man taught us that God is only love. Right. The Christian church taught us that too. But when you read and open the Bible, the Bible don't say God is only love, man. God is a man of war. God kills, man. He makes a lot, man. God has season. He makes peace and he go to war, man. Right now, we at a war with the white man, black man. This is not a war. This is not a physical war. It's a spiritual war. Black man, black man, this war right here, this is a spiritual war, man. This spiritual war, you cannot see it, man. But in the eyes of UBK, we see it, man. Right. And we trying to wake you up so you can see it. Right. Wake up, black man. Wake up, Hispanic man, Native Indian. Because it's time, man. This is war time, man. You living on the battleground of the white man, man. That's why he freely murder you in America and get away with it. You get no justice in America. Right. America wasn't created for you to have justice, man. Let me get um, Deuteronomy 28 and um, 48. Get that Babylon. Show you black man that you are not no African man. 
Right. You never been no stinking African. Right. Never in your life. Just because they found us in Africa don't mean we're Africans, man. Right. We were never African. We were Jews living in Africa. Right. And I'm about to bring out how we ran into, how we was found in Africa. Give me um, Babylon Timbuktu. Yeah, like I was saying, black man, we never been no stinking African. These white people, these white people categorize every dark-skinned people as Africans, man. We never been Africans, never in our life, man. Oh yeah. Yeah, and I'm about to bring this out, how we got into Africa. This is a part of history the white man been keeping away from us, man. If you want to hide something from a black man, you got to put it in the book because black people don't love to read. That's what the white man says. But once a black man learned to read and learn who he is and learn, that his, learn about his past, and now he know where he's going in the future. Because right now, black man, this is what I'm about to show you, how we got into Africa. This is a piece of history that the white man been hiding from us. In the book from Babylon to Timbuktu, page 84, in the year 65 BC, the Roman armies under General Pompey captured Jerusalem. In 70 AD, General Vas Vas Vespasian and his son Titus put an end to the Jewish state. Them white, them white Roman armies came and invade our land, white um, black man. We was living in Jerusalem before we was in Africa. We were sacked by the Roman general, General Pompey, and his son, man. They surrounded our homeland, and they slaughtered us by the millions, man. That we had to find a way and figure out, thanks to Christ. Let me get 21, 21. Thanks to Christ, man. Christ told us to flee from there, man, before, before, before destruction comes. And destruction did come because everything in the Bible comes to pass, man. Right. These white people use the Bible for religion. Bible never been a religion book. That's right. The Bible always been about blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian, man. Right. It's our history book. That's it's right. our culture. Right. It's our heritage. Right. It's our bloodline, man. Right. It's our covenant. It's our agreement with God, man. Right. You white people have no contract with God, That's but right. death coming your way, man. That's right. Let me get um, Luke 21 and 20. The book of Luke, chapter 21, verse 20. And when you shall see Jerusalem come past with armies, then know that the desolation thereof is near. Like Christ was telling us, it's written in what color? Red. It's written in red. Letting you know that Christ is speaking. Letting us know that destruction was coming to Jerusalem after he leaves us, man. After he leaves us, black man, destruction was coming. Just like we suffering under the white man in America, man. He was, he was killing us since he was the, what, Greeks, Romans, and now the Americans, man? Killing us in the streets like dogs, man. Right. He was doing that in the past, man. He was doing that in the past and still doing it till today. Keep going. Verse 21. Then let them which are in Judea flee to the mountains. Flee to where? The mountains. Flee to where? The mountains. We fled into the mountains. Give that brother a hand, man. Hey, do it again. Do it again. <laughs> Step on the seat. Hey, step on the That's right. That's right. That's right. Damn right, brother. Damn right. Damn the white. Damn the white man. The white man's the devil that the Bible speaks of. Like Christ was saying, he told us to flee into the mountain. And we have evidence and proof other than the Bible to prove that that that, that occurred in history, man. It happened. It came to pass. Go back to um Babylon Timbuktu. So we could prove that. The Jewish state? Huh? Oh, uh, uh, With great slaughter. During the period of military governors of Palestine, many outrage and many outrage and atrocities were committed against the residue of the people. Which means we were getting murdered by the millions, black man. 
and still getting murdered till today. Right. The white man always hated us, man. Right. Always, man. Since his, since his, since he came to, since he came out of um Rebecca's womb, man. Was it Rebecca? Rebecca's womb. Since he came out of Rebecca's womb as Esau, man, he been hating us, man. Right. We been fighting in our mother's womb. We Jacob, man. Keep going, it's a lot. During the period from Pompeii to Julius, it has been estimated that over one million Jews fled into Africa. Black man, it has been estimated that over one million Jews fled into Africa. Which show you that we are not no stinking Africans, man. The Africans knew who they were selling. The Africans rounded us up and sold us to the stinking white devil white man, man. The Arabs built the slave ships and the Africans rounded us up and the white man bought us and sold us like we was cattle, man. Keep going, brother. Fleeing from Roman prosecution and slavery. We're fleeing from what? Roman prosecution and slavery. That's the part of history you black people don't know, man. You don't know that you are the real Jews. The Jews, the Jews are black people living in the ghettos, man. In America. And all around the four corners of the earth. But majority of y'all is in America right now. You feel me? We right here living in America suffering under this white devil, man. My Mexican brothers on the borderline suffering under these white devils, man. With this damn lie he's teaching us, man. You got the white devil Donald Trump in the White House putting my brothers in cages, man. And we in the ISUBK, we gonna tell the white man in his face that you are the devil that the Bible speaks of. Because the Mexicans are black people too, man. They my brothers, man. Going down from blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian, I love you brothers, man. We love you up here. Even though, even though you don't get no love from America, but in the eyes of UBK, we show love to our brothers. Because we la familia. On me, man. Nous say on me. We la familia, man. We care, for, we care for our people back here. And we hate the white man. Because God hate the white man. We hate what God hate. And we love what God love. God love the 12 tribe of Israel. And we love the 12 tribe of Israel, which are the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. We are not no stinking Africans. Black man, stop calling yourself Africans. Because you make yourself look bad trying to claim yourself unto a people that's nothing, man. Because they are nobody, man. Just because they black like you don't make them you, man. Right. Is the Japanese a Chinese? So you're going to go to a Chinese and call him a Japanese? Is he the same people? No, man, we ain't the same people like the Chi like the Africans. Don't call us no Africans, white man. That's right. Don't, don't never, ever in your life say we Africans. Right. When you know damn well we ain't no Africans. Right. You ain't murdering no Africans. Africans come to America and they prosper. That's right. right. They, don't share, they, they don't share their wealth with us. That's right. They come to America, they know the black man in America is a different black man, a That's different right. dark-skinned right. race. That's they right. know that. They know we two different race. They don't love black people in America. That's why the Haitians trying to join the African Union, the Africans told the Haitians that they're not African enough. Well, I'm happy the Haitians, I'm happy that we're not African enough Africans. You stinking Africans. I'm happy we didn't get to join you stinking African unions. We didn't want to join your stinking African Union. We don't want it, you can have it. You damn fly on the forehead, African stinking bowl in the lip. Right, right, right. Whatever, cow dung on your head. Right. Rolling in mud, mud hut living, stinking African, running butt naked. So much I want to say about these Africans. Can you, um, let me get, um, Deuteronomy 28 and 32. Yeah, bro, uh, yeah. Like I was saying, man, we in America and we don't even know who we are, man. We living in America. We 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 are lost. We are lost. We are lost. We are lost people in America. That's why Christ. That's why the Bible call us the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Cause we are the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Cause you could you could line up ten black people right here and you'll get ten different identities, man. Cause the black man don't know who he is. Thanks to you white devils, your ancestors stole our identity. 
And we here to claim our wallet back, man. We want what you stole from us. We want it, man. We want that, man. We cry, every, we, we pray to the Lord every day that the Lord bring Christ back so he can rain, rain destruction on your head, man. Let me get Deuteronomy 28, 32, brother. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 32. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto other people. Black man, this Bible is your book. It's your history book. Right. Slavery is in this Bible, man. Right. Who else son and daughter been given to another people? Who else? Can't nobody tell me nothing, man. That's slavery right there, man. Your son and your daughters were given to the white man. The white man was selling you like it was nothing, man. You were sold in the streets of Louisiana, man. Right. By them French devils, man. Right. I'm right here to claim, I'm right here to claim the, my brothers back, man. Right. I'm right here to claim my sisters back, man. Because right. we've been slaves for far too long under this white man, right. man. Right. We've been slaves for far too long. Because right now, we, you, you think you different from the Mexicans, man. The Mexicans, your brother, too. Right. The Hispanics, your brothers, man. Right. The Hispanics are Negroes, man. Right. Right. They're Negroes, too, man. Right. Morenos, man. La That's Familia, right. man. We love our Mexican brothers That's back right. here. Right. We love them, man. We cherish them up back here, man. We love them, man. We trying to unite the 12 tribe of Israel together, man. Because we know and we understand that God and Christ want us back together, man. Right. As one fold again, man. Right now we two sticks, and we gonna put them sticks together and make it one again, man. Keep going, brother. And thy eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long. You know how much pain it is for you to lose your children, your child getting sold? Black man, can you imagine that? Because it, it happened to our ancestors, man. Our child was taken from us, man. And we couldn't do nothing about it. We could, we ain't had no might to do anything about the white man selling our child, man. Right now, we don't even know if we family with each other, but we killing each other like it's nothing, man. You could be, you could be killing your, your cousin, your, your, your close brother, and you don't even know it, black man. Black man, you don't even understand. This Bible's your book, man. Right. This Bible has slavery in it. All in the Bible is about you, man. It's about you, how great you are, man. Right. Don't never let nobody tell you no other, man. You greater than what you think you are, black man. Right. You greater than the white man. The white man never been great. The white man murdered to get everything he has, man. Right. He raped, robbed, and murdered everybody on the planet right. just to live the way he live right now. That's why his head's so high, because nobody could tell him nothing. But in the ICBK, we're going to tell the white man to his face, he's the devil that the Bible speaks of. God damn the white man, man. God damn everything about the white man for what you done to my ancestors, man. What you did to my ancestors, man. I'm living it right now, man. I'm living what you done to my ancestors, man. I'm angry at it. Yeah, I got a right to be angry. Why shouldn't I be angry, white devil? Would you be angry? Would you be mad? Oppression make a wise man mad, and I'm mad, white man. I'm mad what you done to my family. And we hate you, white devils, man. Keep going. And there shall be no might in thy hand. Black man, ain't gonna be no might in your hand when they take your children from you. Ain't gonna be no strength. You ain't gonna have that might because the white man done destroyed you in America, man. He done destroyed you with Christianity. He done destroyed you with white Jesus. Let's wait till this um, sound go by. He done destroyed you through Christianity, black man. Christianity is a way for you to be objective under the white man. Christianity never been about black, black love. Christianity don't show black love. It show black hate, man. Christianity is hate, man. Christianity hate black people. 
The Christian church hate black people, man. They hate us, man. Christianity show us to hate each other and love the oppressor. Right. Now let me get Deuteronomy 28 and 48. Because Christianity been it's been erected since the beginning to show us that we have to bow down to some white God to show the white man that we love him. Right. Like my captain brought out, any God you object to that's, that look like another race, you're going to object to that race, man. Right. Right. All right. You're going to bow down to that race. You love white Jesus, you're going to love white people. Right. Even though they murder you in America, right. you're still going to love them. You always gonna love them till you till you take that white Jesus out of your mind and understand that Christ looked like you, black man. Then you will understand that the white man is the devil that the Bible speaks yes, of. Right, right. Let me get Deuteronomy 28 and 48, brother. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 48. Therefore, thou shalt therefore shalt thou serve thy enemies, which the Lord shall send against thee. Black man, like I was saying from the beginning, this is your book, man. You will serve your enemy. The white man's your enemy. The white man's your enemy. Not just the white man, he's just the number one top hit enemy, man. He's the number one enemy. He's the number one enemy on the list, man. The white man never loved black people, man. He don't love Hispanics and Native Indians. That's why he murder us and get away with it. Let me get Deuteronomy 28 and 48, brother. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 48. Therefore shalt thou serve thy enemy, which the Lord shall send against thee. The Lord sent the white man against us because we broke his commandments. We broke his laws, statutes, and commandments. That's why we getting punished right now under our enemy, the white man, man. The Bible always been a black man book, and they've been talking about us and who our enemy is, black man. The white man is our enemy. That's right. We have to separate our spirit from America, man. That's right. America never loved black people, man. Right. America hate black people. That's right. They hate Hispanics and right. they hate Native Indian. Right. That's why they murder us in the street like dogs, man. Right. They right. get away with it. They get no punishment or no judgment against it, man. Right. But we march and we sing and we shuck and jive for the white man, man. Right. No justice, no peace. We don't need no, we don't we don't need to be saying that man. We need to come back to the Lord so the Lord can give us justice and peace in America, man. Cuz America's going to get destroyed in the future, black man. Black man, America's going to get destroyed in the future, man. You have a black you have a king coming to save you, man. He ain't coming to save everybody. Christ never been a white boy, man. Right. Christ been a nigga from the hood just like you, man. That's right. That's why he died the way he died, man. He died for you, bro. Right. He died to he died for your sins, man. He ain't died for no white people's sins. That's right. What 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 when when did the white man get the law? White people don't get the white man didn't have no law to sin, man. Right. White man don't even understand what sin is. Right. So the white man can do whatever the hell he want, man. But black man, Hispanic man, Native Indian man, we can't do whatever we want. Right. We have a God, man. Right. We have a we have a living power. Right. He gave us he gave us moral laws, man. Right. He gave us laws on our on our own holidays, man. He gave us laws on how to dress, how to conduct ourselves with our brothers and our women's man. Right. Our women supposed to, our women, our women back then in the Bible, man, they would never touch the floor, man. Right. When'd you love that black woman? When'd you love that life again, man? Right. When'd you love the white man to pick your cotton black man? Right. When'd you love that? When'd you love that? The table's gonna turn anyway, cause that's what the Bible say. Right. You gonna reap what you sow, black white man. Right. Right. You done planted murder. You done planted rape. You done planted everything evil, man. And you think nothing's coming for you, man? Right. You have a repercussion, man. And God got your number, white man. Right. God has a hit on the white man. But what God want us to do, God want the black man, Hispanic man, and Native Indian woman and child to come back to him, man. Right. He want his people back. Right. He want us to worship him again, man. Because right. we done lost our ways, man. We done been knocked off the track, man. Because we done followed the white man for over 400 years plus. And the white man been showing us how to, the white man been showing us how to sin real good, just like him, man. Go against our God, man. Because the white man understand once we go against our God, he can, 
he can rule over us for, for as long as he want and do whatever he want to us. Right. Let me get Deuteronomy 28. Keep going. And, and, and hunger, and in thirst, and in nakedness, and in one of all things. When you want some clothes, black man, who you got to go to? You got to go to the white man's store. When you want some food, you got to go to the white man restaurant. Right. When you want some anything you need, you got to go to the white man. Right. Just to show you that the white man's ruling over you, black man. Right. The white man's ruling over you, man. The white man run this earth, man. But he ain't going to be running it for too long because our king is coming back to take it from him, man. Right. That's what the Bible says. The Bible prophesied everything to come to pass. And we read it and we understand that everything that happened in the Bible is true. Because we are the truth. We, we the truth defenders, man. We defend the truth back here. Because there's been nothing but lies. Lies going around in America, man. A whole bunch of lies. And in the ICBK, we are here to tear down them lies, man. Because them lies been going on for far too long. Them lies been going on for far too long, black man. I'm here to show you that we are we are the people of the Bible. The Bible always the Bible the Bible has slavery all in it, black man. And I'm bringing that out right now just to show you that, black man. Keep reading. And he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck. He shall put a what? Yoke of iron upon thy neck. What people had a yoke of iron upon their neck, black man? What people had a yoke of iron around their neck, man? That's showing you right there that slavery's in the Bible, man. We had yokes of iron around our neck, man. Right. In the time of slavery under these white devils, man. Because he put yokes of iron around our neck. Let's see why he put them around our neck and for how long. Until he have destroyed thee. Until he have what? Destroyed thee. Christianity. Destroy thee. Love the white man. Destroy thee. Go to church. Destroy thee. Shuck and job. Destroy thee. Oh my God, the white man is. Why do you hate the white man, brother? Destroy thee. Everybody bleed the same. Destroy thee. The white man has destroyed us in America, black man. That's right. That's why you in the condition you in. Because you've been destroyed after he took them yoke of iron around your neck, black man. That's right. After he done took it off, he proved and showed that you've been destroyed in America. Because he, he done gave you a white God and you done, hate, you done, you done murdered each other like it ain't nothing. Because you love the white man. Right. Every time a black man, if a black man step on another black man's shoe and he, and he murder that brother, just know that you love the white man. Because right. back here we know you love the, black, the white man, man. Black here we love black people, man. Right. We love Hispanics and we love Native Indians. What? No, 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 no